Hey guys! Okay, so every time that I wear my hair like this in one of my videos, you guys always flood the comment boxes like, oh my god, can you please do a hair tutorial? Like, how do you do your hair like that? So I finally filmed it for you guys today so I can show you. I think this would be a great look to wear for like a holiday party this month or New Year's Eve or something like that coming up. I am using my new Bellamy extensions. I'm actually only wearing three out of the 10 West right now, and you'll see in the tutorial, they are so thick and amazing. I absolutely love them. I'm gonna be filming a full review on them on my channel, so that should be up hopefully by next week. I absolutely love them. I have the 22 inch ones, but I'll talk more about the extensions themselves in their full review. But yeah, if you guys wanna see how I got my hair to look like this, then just keep watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to want to do is make a deep side part. Recently, I have been wearing my hair parted in the middle, but for this look to really look exactly the same, you're just gonna wanna do a deeper side part. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to pin back about the top one third of my hair and just get that out of the way because I'm kinda gonna just curl my hair in layers to make it easier and make sure that I don't miss any hair. Then, as per usual, I'm gonna go ahead and spray Sally Hirschberger's Hyper Hydration Spray on my hair, and this is just a heat protectant. It also has keratin in it, and I always use that. And then I am gonna go ahead and just spray some hairspray on my hair, just because if you have second day hair when you're doing this, it'll be fine, but my hair was freshly washed, so I always like to spray hairspray on it right after I washed it, just because a lot of times it won't hold a curl as well as second day hair would. Then I'm gonna go ahead and take my one and a half inch curling iron and about an inch worth of hair and I'm going to curl the hair away from my face. And the curling iron that I'm using is from Hot Tools. I got mine at Harman's. Um, you can get them pretty much anywhere. I know Ulta has Hot Tools and like I said, it's a one and a half inch barrel and I'm just using those size pieces and curling away from my face. This is gonna make a more natural look in my opinion. I just don't like it when the curls go in. It makes my face look weird. This looks better on me, but you can kind of do whatever you want. As you can tell, I am just kind of weaving my extensions in with my natural hair as I am curling them. I'm curling them all together. These extensions actually hold a curl amazingly. After I did my hair like this, I went out for the night and my hair was like totally curled, especially the extensions part. They were actually like more curly than my natural hair. They held a curl so well, so I was really impressed with that. Then I'm gonna go ahead and do the exact same thing on the other side and I am going to cut this out just so I don't bore you guys to death. And then once that's done, I'm just gonna go ahead and spray it just to make sure I lock in the style. The hairspray that I'm using is from Tresme, the same one that I always use. Then I'm gonna take that top third that I kinda pinned back in the beginning, I'm going to bring that down because we're gonna start to curl that now. going to be taking the same size pieces, if anything maybe a little bit smaller than the pieces that I did on the bottom. Sometimes I like my curls on the top a little bit tighter and so I'm just going to take those and curl them away from my face as well.
continue to do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to tease my hair and this is how I get my hair super volumized and big. The teasing comb that I'm using is actually a teasing brush and I got it at Target. You can use any teasing brush or teasing comb. It'll pretty much do the same thing. It'll add lots of volume to your hair. I do have a full tutorial on how I tease my hair. If you guys need more of an in-depth tutorial on how to tease your hair, I will link that in the bottom bar in case you are interested. Once I'm done teasing, I'm just going to kind of smooth out the hair on top so you can't see the part of the hair that I tease. And then I'm also going to bring the brush down through all of the curls just to kind of make the curls a little less perfect and separate them a little bit more. I like that look better for this and I think it makes it look a little bit more volumized. just go and run my fingers through my hair just so I kind of get it how I like it and then the last step is I'm just going to spray my whole head with hairspray just to lock in the hairstyle all night. So yeah, that is the completed look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and I will see you in my next video. Bye!